Hello again. Uh, welcome to Network Lab. And today our lab will be talking about DHCP server on Cisco router. As you already know about DHCP protocol, can be as uh, can be implemented on TP-Link router, uh, Microtech router. Uh, I think most people are familiar with the assigning IP address to uh, clients using these routers already. So this time we will see what a uh, Cisco router can do on DHCP. Okay. So let's do it in GNS3. Um, I will call this project as DHCP. CP server, okay, and I will take one router, one Cisco router, and unmanage switch, okay, I will take unmanage switch, and I take two PCs, and one cloud. Why are you using cloud? I'm using cloud because I want to connect this cloud to my loopback adapter. Okay, we will see. So let me connect this router one, switch, PC one, and PC two, and cloud is staying here. Close here and connect. G0 slash 0 from router 1 to switch, from switch to PC, from PC to switch, and from switch to cloud. Ease 2 is my loopback interface on, the, on my cloud. Okay, I have already configured. So let's show our label. Okay, let's start all devices and we will start our configuration on router 1. Okay, let's go to console on router 1. Yeah, it's already boot up. We go to enable config terminal. And I will assign IP address for router 1. Okay, before I assign, let me write my IP address planning here 192.168.1.1 slash 64 for my router. Okay, let's go back to our console configuration. Uh, INT G0 slash 0 IP address. 192.168.1.1 slash 64.255.255.255.0 okay and no shutdown okay that's it we exit from interface mode then we give the IP the HCP pool name I will give the pool name that my net pool name can be any name okay can be any name okay and then we assign network address what is my network address 192.168.1.0 slash 24 okay this is my network then I will write an exclude address IP the HCP exclude address 192.168.1.1 up to 192.168.1.10 why why I need to exclude uh, these addresses because you see 192.168.1.1 is already assigned to 
g0 slash 0 is the uh, address of the router what about the rest up to 10 i'm sparing for uh, ip address to assign for other devices like if i have another router if i have another switch manage switch or i have another access point i will take from number two three four up to ten ip address okay so among this uh, number one to number ten will be not given to clients okay will be not given to clients this is called exclude address okay after we configure exclude address then we go to ip dhcp pool and then uh, uh, type your name okay type your, your your pool name again what was my pool name my net pool okay and then you could say my default ip so my default router is 192.168.1.1 it means will be your pc's gateway address okay. will be your pc's gateway address enter and what is the dns ip address dns server 192.168.99.99 let's say you have a, a domain name like maybe you have a domain name for domain address from your isp let's say eight eight like that okay uh, actually most um, isp will give dns ip address and as my example i will take um uh, google dns ip okay so you can replace this uh, dns as your isp dns okay then uh, enter if you have a uh, domain name you can also mention here domain name like uh, give example bunta.com okay bunta.com it's my domain name okay just example okay list one that's it we have done our configuration do not forget to uh, write all the configuration on uh, router okay on router Oh, one more thing i i need to change this name to the acp server okay config t host name the acp server okay i change this name okay write it again done let's go to our pc Let's go to our PC here. Right click console. On virtual PC, if you want to assign IP address as obtained like uh, uh, your real PC, you can do IP, sorry, you just say DHCP. It will be uh, looking for the HCP server on your network yes you can see it will start assigning ip address from 11 because we have exclude 1 to 10 already so it will start giving address to clients from 11 and what about pc2 pc2 the cp waiting yes pc2 will be uh, getting ip address 192.168.1.12 this is the gateway okay this is the gateway 
What about cloud? Cloud is our loopback adapter. Yes, let's try. Okay, before trying, let me show you my current address is 192.168.0.3 is my static address. Okay, I take obtain, obtain. Okay. Is it getting address or not? Okay. Let's see together. Status detail. Yes, we got address. 192.168.1.13 okay 13 here we have um 11 12 and here is 13 okay our gateway is 1.1 1 .1, 1 .1, okay and dns is 88 you have assigned on router one just now how to see how many address was given to clients on router how to see it? we type command show ip dhcp binding okay we can see oh i have uh, 192.168.11 uh, 12 13 okay Two is automatically uh, assigned. Okay. Yeah, I think that's it for today. And uh, where is the number two? What one? Number two belong to which address? He lets me find. Select tick. Uh, this number two will be somewhere in router only, not on our devices. Okay, somewhere in this one. But for this three, you can see is active address. Okay, for three PCs. This is my Windows 10 PC. This is virtual PC. This is virtual PCs. Okay. Um. Yeah, I think that's all for our configuration on DHCP, uh, DHCP server configuration on Cisco router. What about the switch? If you have a Cisco managed switch, you also can assign this uh, DHCP address. Okay, it's the same command. Okay, you can apply this command to your Cisco managed switch. Okay, the same. So. I think that's all for today and thank you for watching and if you have any comment uh, any questions any doubt please comment below the video and do not forget to subscribe for getting alert more video of uh, networking configuration thank you